uh, Aiden from Eastern Block Air Guns. Instead of an air gun, today we have our crossbow, and it's a Horton Summit 150, and it's got a hundred pounds of draw length on it, and we've got a Hawk Vantage scope that we are gonna have um, scope cam footage on, and we just we've been sighting it in today. Uh, to get it ready for the pig hunt tomorrow. And uh, we've got these uh, bipod, this bipod on it. It's not too bad, but it's, it's a good good enough bipod. It's not too expensive. It's probably about a uh, $230 setup. Not too expensive. We've got our quiver to hold extra arrows. And we're going to try to get some pig. All right, we're at 27 yards. We're gonna to test to see if it's sighted in. Yeah, we're testing to see if the scope can get knocked around. We're gonna take one shot. Okay, go. Sounded like a good hit. Did it? Um, I was aiming for the hamburger, but I think when I shot, took the shot, I kind of moved it a little bit before I took the shot, and it ended up in the way end of the side of where this hot dog is. And at least I didn't miss up or down, and I think our trajectory is still all good, and we're ready for the hunt tomorrow. Um, it's the morning of the hunt, and the ranch owner said that he hid the pigs last night somewhere around this 300 acre fenced in area and I'm really excited because I've been shooting this bow a lot and getting ready for it. Let me show you the clip. Better. Better. And, um, yeah, let's get some piggies. high ground to go check. We've been out here for like an hour, we can't find them. We checked along the upper ridge and here, but we think that we can maybe see them over this hill, but still no sign of them. Not here. 200 acres is a lot. We've been looking for this place for about two hours now, up and down hills. I fell a few times, hurt my ear, and I just want this pig dead. Something that smelled like a pig, like a pig farm, around here. When we're walking in here, we're gonna go check down here in this. A uh, little valley is place, and hopefully we find the pig. It's midday. We came over by the pond to see if we could find this pig. It's been really tough. We've been going almost everywhere, circling like the whole entire property looking for this pig. So we thought it might be over here at the pond, cooling that down because it's getting hotter. But no sign of it yet. 
Good shot. 24 would be right on. 24? No, Perfect shot. What do you think? I hear for about three, three, maybe four hours just walking around. It's got really tiring. And then we found this pig just laying over by the pond. Cause we, we originally walked over to the pond just to see if it was actually here because it was hotter in the day. Pig might be hot, want to take a swim. So then, we walked over here and we came up and it was right underneath this big cliff ridge area in the shade and as we started approaching it, it kind of started leaving the area. So I had to quickly take a shot. It was right at 28 yards, perfect sighted in range for our crossbow. Took the shot and it hit straight into the heart and probably punctured one lungs, but this is a big fat pig, a lot of meat. How'd the crossbow do? Crossbow's good, aimed straight where I aimed, perfect For shot. For a cheap crossbow, it works well. Yeah, after falling a few times, too, looking for it, perfect. 